Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can fix a problem with a black screen of death on the iPhone 12 series, iPhone 12, iPhone 12 Pro or the Pro Max. And um, sometimes it is a battery cannot charge issues. So if you have these issues, uh, the first things that you can do is first, make sure that your phone have uh, some power in it so you want to plug your phone into a charger for maybe say two hours just to make sure that it is uh, charged also check your charger to make sure that your charger is working correctly you can do that by uh, simply trying to charge another device now if you do not have another iphone sometimes it can be hard to test but um, just try to use check that charger to see if you can use that charger with uh, another device uh, whether it's an android device or your older mobile phone just to confirm that the charger is working uh, next you may want to con also confirm that your charging cable is working correctly and after that um, just uh, if the charger and the charging cable is working correctly um, make sure that you have your phone charge up maybe for an hour or two and then after that what you can do is um, first you can press on the volume up, then volume down, then press on the side key. So this is what you do. You press on volume up, volume down, and then press on the side key. Now you want to press and hold this for around 10 seconds or until you see the Apple logo appear on the screen. Once you see the Apple logo appear, you can let go of the side button and let it um, put up. Now this is a force restart or a soft reset. So you can give it a try first to see how you go. Now another thing that you can do is if that does not work, then you can try to plug your charger cable into the device and make sure that the charger on the wall is turned on. So turn on your charger. And then again, we will try to force restart your iPhone 12. So we press on the volume up key and then immediately release and then press on the volume down key and then straight away release and then press and hold on the side key so let's try it now um, press on the volume up volume down and then press and hold on the side button or the power button until you see the apple logo appear on the screen now if you have tried both methods and if it's still not working then it is very likely that uh, there may be a battery fault or it could be that if you recently update your software the software can cause an issue with the charging uh, ports down here or the battery uh, in that case uh, if um, you try to force restart your device and it's still not working you may need to bring your device into an apple store to, uh, for them to have a look at it now if your device is under two years um, sometimes in certain country you there is a consumer law warranty where it is um, that where you have um, two years warranty and Apple will um, will fix the problem for you for free so it doesn't cost you anything you just need to bring it to the store so they can check it out uh, if it's not uh, physically damaged or you intentionally damage the device then um, in most cases they will fix it for free for you so um, we're going to try it out this device here has been um, something's wrong with it I don't know what's wrong uh, at the moment uh, because it's um, the battery doesn't charge. I try to reset it. I try to soft uh, reboot um, with these methods. It doesn't uh, turn on. And uh, it's very likely that the battery, there is a fault with the battery. But in most cases, um, it should work. So, for example, like this device here, this is the iPhone 11. So, if you press on the volume up key, then volume down key, and then press and hold on the side key. You should see your phone boot up with an Apple logo like this. Once once you see the Apple logo, then there is hope that your device will boot up normally and there shouldn't be any problem at all. So once you see the Apple logo appear immediately, let go of the button and your device should boot up uh, normally. If it doesn't, then that's bad news guys. That means um, very likely that you have an issue with your device um, could be a software after an update or it could be an internal issues with the battery now because this device is still under warranty so I'm not going to open this up uh, because then um, I would void the warranty so I'm going to 
have Apple to look at this device, but um, if you don't have a warranty anymore, you can um, take it to, if not Apple, you can take it to another store. They can open it up and maybe if the, if it's a battery issues, they can replace the battery uh, for you. And that's it. You can see here, if we follow that procedure where you press the volume up, then volume down, then press and hold on the side button, your phone should boot up uh, normally. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos. And good luck guys. Hope you can get your device uh, back up running. Thank you for watching.